the first squad. Oh god, I'm fucking retarded. <laughs> to demonstrate how to make your own persona, use this helpful app. I don't know if it's for the Android or something. I forget what it's called. Whatever. It's a furry maker app. So if you're a furry out there and you're like, I don't know how to make my own persona. Because most personas that are actually good are taken. A uh, hint, hint, Tayer's persona. God, if that wasn't taken, I would be like, hey. That's pretty good. But, you know. Tayer's school. I love Tayer. Your dancing is on point. But let's not get a side trick. Say you want to make, like, a blue wolf, then you would probably pick something blue, like a sky or something. I don't really fucking know. And then you would go down here and, you know, you know, find something you would like. You know, let's say this, for example. This looks really good. I like this one. And then we're going to pick an eye. So, you know, I love this a little, like, you know, that eye, I suppose. I like that eye. And you can choose a color eye you want it to be. So we're going to go for a lightish blue. It's okay. You don't get the right color for all, all your eyes. I do the same thing because, you know, it's kind of hard to get all the colors. See, if it's a bit lighter than you just adjust it so it's like almost the same shade as the other one. Pretty darn close. And you pick your mouth. Let's give him a little bone. Oh, that is so adorable so far. No, okay. You can give him a tennis ball too. I think a bone would fit him because he is a little doggy dog. Next, we're gonna pick what kind of ear you want. We're gonna do really little fluffy, fluffy ears, and then you would pick what you know shade you want it to be. Uh, it's pretty light blue, so we're gonna go for like a blue that's like I don't know the same shade as like the blue that's on like the head. So you know. In this case, it's a light blue. So yeah, we're just gonna go for like... And that's a light blue like that. That's not... Hang on. That's pretty close. We'll, we'll deal with that for now. Then you can pick what kind of legs you want. We're gonna stick with the default legs for now because... Yeah. Then you got robot legs, you got short legs, you got furry legs, you got weird legs, you got more weird legs, and you got like all these other legs matching with different skins, you got like, you know, all that good stuff. Then you got the tails, so the tails are probably my favorite part, because you get to do whatever you want with them, you get to change your color, and such. We're gonna give you our dog a little waggy wag tail, we're gonna also change the color of that as well. So, yeah, let's make it a nice little shade of blue. Almost the same shade as the ears. And it's, as long as it's close, I think you'll be fine. If you really want to, you can go tough on the head. And it's quite easy to mimic this one because, you know, it's just gray. There. We'll give him a darker spot circulate just to make him look kind of cool. And here is the fun part. You get to decorate him a bit. Take him like a collar. A plushie, a uh, any other thing that you think would really fit your fursona. We're gonna leave them like this for now. And then you got you know like all like these other extra furs. Like if you want to be really furry, you can. Although that kind of ruins the design. But yeah, if you want to add extra fur, you can. Blood, you want <laughs> for those edgy furs. Other, not saying that you are edgy fur, but just saying, bro. Don't be mint. So then you have like little paw prints and scorpions and blushes i don't care i'm giving an anime blush that looks adorable and then no we'll do that that is adorable guys so now that we have done that we actually get to go here and i already have a persona i'll show all my personas with you guys in a little bit but here you can save your avatar in these empty slots and if you don't worry if you run out of slots it's fine all you gotta do is watch a couple videos and you gain more slots. Now we're going to save them as an image. Just to make sure you actually saved your fursona. <coughs> now if your fursona is a cat. Or any other animal besides like a wolf. Or a, a type of dog. Then this app may not be for you. Although there are other apps out there as well. Then if you want to be creative. Well, let's just clear this real quick. If you want to be creative. No. <laughs> If you want to be creative, you could just do random avatar and it'll give you something fucking weird. Okay, I gotta mute this. This is copyright. Oh, God. Copyright striked. Okay. I don't know if ads can be copyright striked. I'm staying on the safe side of YouTube. 
See, it gives you weird fucking designs. Like, what is that? No. But, and then, hey, there's a furry right there. Alright, so those are all of your personas done. Now you get to go and check out your personas. This is our newest one. Don't know his name yet. We're gonna name you Sky Pup. Yeah, Sky Pup. This one is my fox one. This is Joey. This is what did I name you? I named you Jet, right? Yeah, you you were Jet. This is my first son. Her name's Cherry. She's so fucking adorable. <laughs> I gave her Markiplier hair just because I like Markiplier. Then there's Cookie. You know, I like all of Cookie. Then there's Gallet. Then there no, that's not Gallet. Well, <laughs> what a stupid name. What did I name her? I think I just named her Galaxy. I am not creative with names. Then this is Haze. So these are all my personas. There are seven of them, I think. Yes, seven. So then I showed you all how to make your own persona. Hopefully you can take it from... It's pressure from this video to make your own persona. I will see you all next episode and... Uh, bye. I need to come up with a intro and outro. Please help me.